Okay, we're live. We're live on Facebook. Hopefully it's working on Facebook. Let's see. There we go. Okay, just waiting for people to show up. It's 10 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. I'm hoping everyone can join me. Okay. So welcome to my craft room this morning. Oh, here comes Carmen. Welcome to my craft room. We're gonna do some mystery stamping. Good morning, Carmen. Good morning. How come every time I go live, I get an itchy nose? Just because. <laughs> Yeah, um, I think I need one more person to join us before I can spotlight my video. So I'm not quite sure. Well, let me just log in with my phone. That'll give us the third. Of course, it all helps if I know where the link is. Yeah, I spent I bookmarked it when I seen it in the morning yesterday. Yeah, I didn't have time to do it right away. So last night when I went to do it, it took me over just close to an hour to find it. Oh. Oh yeah. I, I oh, that's the wrong one. Not impressed with that. I decided <laughs> I'm taking a picture from now on. To heck with this. Yeah. No kidding. Well, let's find my Zoom app. Sometimes when I go on Facebook on my phone, good morning, Valerie, it does some weird stuff. So my computer does weird stuff. Eight. This one. Join that meeting. Let's see if this is going to work. Ah. Uh, nope. Oy vey. How come it sometimes it, oh, there's a rain. Oh, good. Now I can spotlight. Hello. Hi. Now it won't spot, let me spotlight my video if there's only two of us. I don't get it. <laughs> oh, well. Good morning, Lorraine. Good morning. It just took me a while. I couldn't get Zoom to open up. I could see on Facebook, but I couldn't get Zoom to open uh, up. Now we're here. I now we're here. At least you here. And I'm so rushed. I'm eating my breakfast out of the container. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh gosh. And now I've been I've been dealing with a lady with to get some fresh rhubarb and she just sent me two messages. So she's going to have to wait till I'm done. I'm sorry. Oh. I could give you a whole pile. <laughs> oh, I'll take any rhubarb that you don't want. <coughs> I just, it was as bad as, not as bad as, as, as abundant as the plums. And, and then I've got another load that are, it, it's grown in again. So that's like, no, oh, four Yum. huge pickings. Yeah. I eat rhubarb every day. Oh, do you? Good. I, do. Wow. I eat it. I eat it in my pudding at night before I go to bed. Nice. It is. So I'm always looking for rhubarb. So if you have a bunch and you don't know what to do with it, just throw it in the freezer. You can leave it long. Just throw it in the freezer in a bag and I'll pick it up next time I'm over there and I'm willing to pay you for it. Oh my God, I wouldn't take any money for it. I can't give it. I put it in bags at the end of the driveway. Oh my God, that I breaks my it. heart. <laughs> There just is so much, you know, it's really nice when it comes and yeah. make muffins and make an upside down sort of cake thing and a crumble and have it, yeah, stewed rhubarb. And then it's like, oh God, so I give it to Betty, I give it to Jeanette, I give it to oh. Maria, I give it to here. I just can't get rid of it. Pick me, pick me. <laughs> remember, I'll go out there, maybe not today, but I'll pick you some. Oh Lord. Yeah, well, I grew up on um, stewed rhubarb and runny custard. 
<laughs> and it's so good. And now this pudding that I have every night for this eating thing that I do, I put my rhubarb in there and it's just like having stewed rhubarb and runny custard. I love it. That's a cute. We used to go out to the gut. Oh, sorry. That's okay. You don't stew your rhubarb uh, before you put it freeze it? You don't have to, no. No, I, I know I we don't on that, but be, uh, sorry, before you eat it, I should say. Oh, before I eat it. Oh, yeah, I stew it before okay. I eat it. Yeah. yeah. But um, as a kid, we used to cut the corner off a paper bag, put sugar in it, and go out to the garden, pick the rhubarb raw, and just dip it in the sugar and, and eat it. Yeah, we didn't do a paper bag. We did a bowl. We just sat in the middle of the rhubarb with a bowl and and a and eating it right out of the garden. Oh. Always to dream of having a bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently I was highfalutin with oh, my rhubarb eating. I was Scottish. <laughs> it was a paper poke we had. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. Well let's let's start something here. So are both are, is everybody crafting with me? I am. I am. Uh, Yay! Maria's not home yet, so. No, and she doesn't have Wi-Fi. Oh, well. No. Pretty iffy. And what is the smoke situation over there today, Val? Or, I mean, Lorraine? It's better than it was yesterday. Yeah. Um, but we still can't see very much. Uh, yeah, it's ugly here. It's and like a heavy fog. It's really difficult for people that have respiratory issues right now to go outside. Well, more I was thinking about um, John and Maria. Yeah. That's all be tough. Yeah. But I talked to her yesterday. Guido's having a good time. Well, she was in swimming. I'm thinking, oh my God, that's <laughs> the cold, coldest water down there. And she was <laughs> in for ages and ages. She said she just come out at one point. I thought, oh my God. Oh my God is right. Oh. Where are they at? Kent's Beach, it's south of town, almost at the at Sultry Bay Ferry Terminal. They're um, on the Powell River Peninsula thing. Okay, so take your six pieces of designer paper that are one by do you want to see the back of the card? <laughs> I'm showing you the front. Okay, six pieces of designer series paper that were three quarters of an inch by two an inch. And you're going to take them and lay them in a staggered pattern at the topish part of your card. All right. Are we just folding the, the card, the base in half? Yes, ma'am. Okay to do that first. Ooh. Okay, my adhesive went where I didn't want it. Valerie, are you crafting with us? My um, designer paper has a pattern, so I can't start putting it on until I make sure the pattern flows. So just across the front of the card, staggered. And you want to leave enough room so you can put your sentiment on, which is that um, five and a quarter by one and a half inch piece of whisper. You must wipe. overlap them, me, eh? Or do you cut them off? No and no. Does that make sense? My card is hamburger. Not well, hot I put dog. a hamburger and three of them, three of them go off the edge, so I can't do three. Okay. My brain is not working. Oh well. Then we'll see what you come up with. Oh, wait, before you put them on permanently. Holy Aunt Jemima, where's my brain? I'm going to emboss my card base. The front of my card base. So you can, or you don't have to. I'm not going to then. I've already got too many pieces on to rip off. <laughs> I'm 
apologies. I completely forgot that step. Okay. Got it. Pardon me? I figured it out. Yay. <laughs> I knew you would. Uh oh. It's debatable some days. I haven't. I haven't. No. Nope. Okay. Issue. Apparently, I wasn't using it right. Oh, crud. It went crooked in the machine. Don't you hate that? Well, I'm going to redo it and we'll see what happens. We may end up with a real mess and we'll have to get another card base, but oh well. That's life. Hey, you can't even tell I had to double do it. All right. Now I'm going to put my strips on. Oh, okay. You will the thing. And they all have adhesive and they're all sticking to each other. Now we're going to figure this out again. Because <laughs> I decided I wanted my card base done too. Good. Make sure I get my my uh, pieces going in the right direction here. Oh, was that something we were supposed to do? <laughs> <laughs> oh well, I'm already. Mm. That's okay. Yeah. Because your card is your card. Yeah, and it won't be going to anybody else. <laughs> Well, I cleared a nice spot for my new machine arriving tomorrow. It'll be right behind me in the corner. Ooh, how exciting. Excited. Carmen, I figured out a way to get some new supplies and things. Oh, did you? How did you do that? I invited my husband to make my birthday card. So he joined me and made a card from himself and from my dog and had a wonderful time doing it, but thought that my little um, cuddle bug machine was awfully stiff and couldn't manage. And, and I said, well, it's old now, it's 15 years old. And I would love to get a new one, but and he said, oh, well, why don't you? And I said, oh, well, it's 160 odd dollars. I can't really afford. Oh, yeah, we're going to be making more cards. You need a good one. <laughs> <laughs> good job. So, so my plan is, he says, we'll do this again. My plan is to get things that I want and get the old shabby stuff and use that and say, oh, if only. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, oh. I can't do that. There's just me to buy them. Oh. <laughs> That's okay. So apparently Heather and the boys are going to join us on Zoom. Oh, wow. That would be cool. I haven't yeah. seen the kids for a couple of days. Oh, they yeah. started their homeschooling. Did they? Okay, so now I'm going to stamp my sentiment in a very bright, cheery color on to the whisper white that is one and a half by two and a half. One and a half by two and a half. I don't have that. Oh, half. well, I'm sure you can make it happen. I have one and a half by five and a half. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh. You're halfway there. I am. Yeah. I might get these pieces stuck on next year sometime. <laughs> the hardest part is getting them straight and then getting them so that they're relatively spaced out. Yeah. 
but that's okay. And I already made one mistake on one of them. I put it up when I should have put it down. Uh, not a mistake. That's my card. <laughs> Three up and three down. Uh huh. I should copy that. That link. Shop Carmen, not. Come on. While I'm waiting for you guys to catch up. I'll just copy the link into the comments section. I just love having everything here. <laughs> yeah. Nice, isn't it? Just reach, reach, reach. Mm -hmm. Even have my breakfast here. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Louise. You're not joining us on Zoom. There's the there's the link. All right, get this back where it was because I had it set up so that I could monitor all different things. Finally made it to the holy crap factory, but they weren't <laughs> they weren't open. Oh, we over in Seashell. Yeah, what's well, in Gibson's and we always pass it on oh, the Gibson's right to the ferry and I said to Glenn, oh, I need some more holy crap. So on the way down, we'll stop. We didn't manage on the way down and on the way back. We had a little time, so we went in, but it looks like it hasn't been open for ages. They're storing boxes and everything in the. Oh. Oh, I don't think they're open to the public. Ah, uh, yeah, they might have closed that when the whole COVID thing started. So. So Heather's got her video on, but there's no audio. Oh, there's a little face. Hello. <laughs> Hello. We're just waiting for the boys to come back inside. They have the dogs outside. Oh, <laughs> it's recess. Of course, oh, well. we'll be outside. Exactly. <laughs> Gotta love school homeschooling. I would be homeschooling my kids if they were. Me too. That age right now. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to put that whisper white piece that I stamped my sentiment on. I'm going to layer that onto the five and a half by one and three quarter inch piece of whatever color you chose. And you'll see what my color is when I'm all done. Here's my ruler. Um, <laughs> left hand drawer at the top. I don't oh. know. <laughs> now, did I pop that? Nope, did not pop that. Oh, were we supposed to pop it? Nope. Nope. I was just checking to make sure I didn't. Now I'm going to take that whole thing, the white and the color, and put it onto the card front. Popped? Not popped. Not popped. Not popped. Maybe I should answer that woman so she doesn't give my rhubarb away. Well, you oh, bet. Yeah. Next was the sentiment. Yes. Okay, so now I have. Okay, I Let's see. Six, 13 and a half, 23 and a half, 23, 28, 29.25 pounds of rhubarb coming to my house this afternoon. <laughs> Cha ching. <laughs> Yay. I lost my stamp stuff. Oh, Lord. I just. <laughs> Oh, this is not a good morning. <laughs> oh, there it is. Yay. Under the die cut. 
Come on, lady. You don't have to answer me 14 times when I say yes. Just say you're welcome. You're welcome. Thanks. Now go away. I'm busy. Woman doesn't know I have a life. Maybe I should just send her the link, my Zoom link, and she can join us. Yeah, really. Come on, lady. Okay, why is the video stopped over on my Facebook page? Really? This is hmm. not working. Hmm. I don't know why it left me. Left me. Hmm. So when I did this on the weekend, it was it was Zoom acting up, and now Facebook's acting up. Really? Okay, so those of you on Facebook, I'm sorry, I'm coming. I just have to figure out where it went. There it is. I was gonna be very rude there. <laughs> be nice, G-rated. Okay, apparently it doesn't want to cooperate. So let's put you guys on that side. Yeah, right. There. Okay. Now, if nobody moves, we'll be fine. Okay. So have you got your sentiment on top of your colored cardstock on top of your strips, which are on your card base? No, Say I'm that busy. three times real fast. I'm busy coloring my hand. You're coloring your hand. See, I opened the ink. Oh. And it's what? Oh, don't you hate but, that? That's me. But you guys go ahead, don't. All right, so the next step, I'm going to stamp two images to put onto my card front. One I'm going to pop and one I'm going to put flat on where the sentiment is, but they're both going to be stamped and die cut. And they're different colors. Say that again. <laughs> yeah. uh. I said, good morning, Diana. Um, I said, I'm going to stamp two images right. and die cut them. And okay. one is going to be flat and one I'm going to pop. Okay. Okay, huh. I added I left out some extra stuff in there. So yes. and while I'm at it, no one won't. I was gonna stamp the inside of the envelope, but I won't. I'll do my die cutting. Of this to get myself organized. Okay. My dies are right here. Do, 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 do. Come on. Okay, doing my die cutting now. Oh. This card does not take long to do. To put together. The longest part is the prep of the pieces. How are we doing? <laughs> okay, then. Okay. Oops. 
rid of the garbage. My card base. Put, find some dimensionals. Are those children still outside with the dogs? They're going to miss the whole thing. Oh, well. That's OK. <laughs> <laughs> Do they know I'm on, or did you tell them before they went out? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> and it's all 1030. <laughs> <laughs> I did tell them they didn't have to stay out there forever, but. <laughs> They have, um, they're having fun out there. Yeah. Okay, it says Louise is on here. Is Louise on here? I don't see you, Louise. I don't know where you are. She's not on. Not on Zoom. Zoom. Well, it, I got an email that says Louise has joined your meeting. Oh my gosh. Poor Louise, she does have issues when it comes to joining the, the whole thing. Let me see if I can find her in Messenger and send her a link. You know, when I go through the uh, link that you put in um, on Facebook there, yeah, I have a lot of trouble with that one. But if I go into Zoom and just paste in the number that you give us, I have a lot better luck with that. Oh, weird. Yeah. And for me, it's the other way around. Yeah, I, I, I think it's just it's there to drive us all. I always just type the number in and then it works just fine. Yeah, oh, yeah, I cut and paste it, but the same thing. <laughs> I just click the link. Yeah, and it just spins its poor brains out when I click the link. Weird, eh? Well, yeah. I don't know where she is, but I sent her a message. One's flat and one's popped, right? Yes, ma'am. Oh, nice. Oh, there it is. Oof, I thought I'd lost it. Flat. Here they come. Shh, everybody be quiet. We'll surprise them. <laughs> I'm going to mute it until it's not so loud. <laughs> Okay, hey, that one's going to go there ish. This one's going to go here ish. That one needs to move over oh. a bit. I don't think I was meant to do. Oh, there, found my whale. Yay. Oh, I have to do a, an anniversary card for my hubby. Oh. And I'm going to use the whale stamp set. Hi, Grandma. Hello, sweetie. <laughs> hey, guys. This is art class. Art class, yep. <laughs> yep. There's the other one. I'm trying to hide. <laughs> Hi, Cameron. He's still in jammies. <laughs> you can't see what's below <laughs> oh that's funny you don't have to get dressed anymore at all he could stay in his jammies forever yep pretty he much looks like on the news who did that in victoria <laughs> was in his pajamas for 180 days or something good for him yeah Maybe oh, I, I bet Cameron could beat that. I don't think he's been <laughs> dressed since last year at this time. Well, not unless he put his clothes on to go to bed in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> You've done that a few times, but then there's still class his pajamas, if you ask me, because he's still <laughs> going to go to bed. <laughs> okay, I'm stamping my inside now. What are you doing? I don't know where Louise went. Louise, did you ever find us on Zoom? I can't see her, but. 
No, she commented on Facebook. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I can't use it's weird. Hmm. Okay, my stamping is done. I'm just going to put my inside inside. I just can't remember to put, put it down so you can see grandma. Hello. I miss you guys. You haven't been over for a while. Nope. Oh, I miss you too. And you haven't been over. Oh, oh, you're not talking to me. Oh. <laughs> yes, I am. Oh, I see. Yeah, bring your boys in and that's it. The rest of us are pop liver. That's it. No, not liver, because I don't like liver. <laughs> hamburger. Pop hamburger. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I was busy all day Saturday, Friday and Saturday doing those um, mm. Facebook lives for the fall fair and I didn't get anything done other than that. So yesterday I went out and pulled all my cucumbers and all pulled out the cucumber and the zucchini plants and I found a, a cucumber that was like this long. Mm, yummy. And a bunch of little ones and then some little tiny zucchinis. Oh darn, my friend asked if I wanted any uh, tomatoes or cucumbers and I forgot to pick them up before I left. Oh. I picked about seven zucchinis last night. I think I'm done with them now. <laughs> <laughs> Heather, did you hear that I have a whole bunch of rhubarb coming? Yeah. I'll share. Oh good. I don't have to need it all for me. <laughs> And Lorraine has rhubarb if, if she so kindly saves it for me and I eventually get over there. I'll have some from there too. I'll put Yay. it in the freezer. I'll just Yay. chop off the top and the bottom and put the yep. stalks in the freezer. Thank you. That would be awesome. Val and I had a nice day on Saturday. We went to Barb's landscaping garden place south of town. She was selling pots of perennials and things so we went there and got some plants but we happened to see a garage sale and we scored big 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 Val got gold jewelry wow I got four rings three rings one with an opal one with an amethyst one with lapis lazuli and a French fabric bag a designer bag and a shopping bag and some other things all for six dollars Oh my gosh. Val got two pairs of earrings and I think she said one was 10 karat gold and one was 14 karat gold. And um, she got a ring too, I think maybe, I can't remember now, but we, yeah. So that was wow. exciting. <laughs> that was my last hurrah farewell. I'm leaving the world again. I don't blame you. I just don't want to get a cold even or anything, you know? Nope. Nope. Yeah. Uh, it's really up in the air at the moment whether I even come over on Sunday or not. Yeah. As um, Krista's checking things out today and she's going to make her decision and then we'll go from there. But I figure we can do the class virtually. If, virtually, yeah. Yeah. It's just Val that needs to figure out a way to do it. And I'm sure she could go visit somebody that's in her bubble and use oh, their she Zoom. Can do Zoom. She can do Zoom. It just won't be on Sunday because I'm not going to be able to get the kits over to you by then. Yeah. But I can mail them out and we can do it next week. Let me see my, my, cal my calendar. Where'd it go? I think that's probably the safest option. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we could do it on the 27th. Just bump it back a week. 27th. I couldn't do it on the 27th. Okay. But that's okay. Well, maybe I could do it from, no, I wouldn't have any. I could watch. <laughs> Where, when do you leave to go down there? I have my surgery on the 25th. Oh, right. So I will be down there still. Okay. We might have to do it in an evening then. No, 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 no. You go ahead and do yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll just, uh, like, I can do it from wherever I am. 
I just can't do it. I can watch and follow along and join in the company. And that's fine. I can do it when I come home. Yeah. Are you going to stay in Vancouver for a few days? Yeah. The doctor says best to, she says, take a, about a week to recover. But I'm uh, not going to stay that long. Apparently, um, Pacific Coastal gives you 30% off your airfare for a medical. Oh, nice. So, uh, and, and it's not, and it's a, you know, the cheap fare that I always go on, that's it. If you have to cancel, you just lose your money. Yeah. No, no change in dates or anything, but this one, they, you can change because the surgery often gets canceled at last minute or whatever. So, cool. to know. <laughs> so um how was catching the ferry down there on thursday do they have the ferries lined up pretty the ferry good going down was fine and we were kind of alarmed seeing the number of people coming up on the thursday because we went we went the 925 ferry and already the parking lot was full when we got to earl's cove so coming back it was horrendous and when we got off at um, Horseshoe Bay, the whole parking lot was full. The upper parking lot was full. It was full out to the, the stands. When we came, yeah. we had to sit. We, we were quite excited because the lineup wasn't out onto the freeway like it sometimes is, but that's usually for Nanaimo. Yeah. So we got into the, coming into the first parking lot and we were quite excited. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we were stopped before the, the, the booths. Yeah. And we had to wait there for, quite some time an hour and a half maybe before we got to the booth wow and then we weren't even in the parking lot when we got down i took pictures <laughs> in front and behind us but yeah um, that was okay and then we had a fair bit of time to get up to the other ferry so we did some shopping on the way a little bit uh, holy crap <laughs> and, um and then when we got up to the upper one, I thought, oh, we're not going to get on this ferry because we were in about this, the lane that usually has the overheights and things. But we yeah. did got on. They squeezed everybody in really well. and Oh, nice. Everything. So, yeah, that wasn't bad. And it was a nice day and the fog was starting to come in. Yeah, yeah that smoke, the pain. There's, I've seen a couple of pictures from up the lake. Mm -hmm. You can barely see the other side of the bays. I know. We The first night we were there, so we were staying in North Vancouver at Lonsdale Key, right at the Key. Scott got a nice hotel for us there. And the view was lovely, right across to the Sears Harbor Tower and the Five Sails and, and nice. State Park and, and Lionsgate Bridge and the ferries going back. It was lovely. And at nighttime, all the lights came on, so it was lovely. In the morning, we got up and we could barely see Vancouver. Oh, yeah. Wow. I don't, do you know, have, have they got the fires under control yet, or is it still burning like crazy down there? They're still burning, but we're due to get rain, and they're saying that that's going to help the situation greatly. Well, I was excited yesterday because I went to the store and there was raindrops on my windshield. Oh, really? And they lasted up from my house to, what is that school at Sun Compton? A.W. Neal? Neal, yeah. And, and then there was no more. And it wasn't even enough to put my windshield wipers on other than to see that there was moisture on my window. We do need rain. I, I was hoping I wouldn't have to go out and water today and stand there and not crud, but looks like I'm going to. Well, what a pretty card. Nothing Are we done? I'm sure. <laughs> hmm. Valerie says it's supposed to be bad for 24 to 72 hours. Yeah. Yuck. Oh, well. I'm not going anywhere. I'm staying in my, staying in my craft room. Making some cards, cutting some card stock. <laughs> I prepped for my tool bench hold class yesterday. So I'm, that's how far ahead I am. 
Val's on her Christmas card, so. Ah, <laughs> uh, I've been making those since when? July. Yeah, she was too, so I know. Yep. She's just um, organized all her, her um, Christmas paper and embellishments and everything. So I think she's starting after this class. She's going to do some today. uh organized i had i couldn't sleep last night i was laying there thinking i really need to get in my craft room and do those corners you know the corners where you just push stuff back and then you put other stuff in front of them yeah i could have a whole other garage sale just the crap i've got in my corners do it do it do it <laughs> valerie a mask with volkswagens on it yeah, they were cute. That would be cool. They were cute. There's tons on Etsy. Oh, is there? Yeah. Well, I finally found one that um, actually fits my face. So I'm really excited. I had to buy a kid's mask. I um, took a picture and put it on um Facebook yesterday. I've got an old antique um, oak hall stand that all our coats hang on and there's a mirror in the middle and, and along the top it's my hat rack and all the hats are on it so yesterday I added my mask rack because I now have so many masks and it's going to be with us for so long so right at the door as I go out I have a little bird hanger with two little hooks on it and all my masks are hanging on that now so I thought sign of the yeah. times it is yeah if I'm going to be wearing them for the next however long, I'm going to start wearing nice ones, so. Valerie, I used to sew everything. I sewed my clothes, my kids' clothes, my hubby's clothes, but then I, I found other things I'd rather do. <laughs> Can't imagine. Well, the only thing I sew now is hems on my pants. Which is what I have on my list today. I have three pairs of pants to sew. Uh, the pants arrive, so I have that to do. When you're short like us, Glenda, you gotta sew hems. Yep, it's true. Well, you don't gotta because staplers work really well too. Yep. And, oops, can't see here. Oh no, wait a minute. What are you trying to do? Hand your. Also, just buy the petite. It's so much easier. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Double cuff. <laughs> Petites fit me perfectly. Yeah, yeah, but you can't find petites all the time. No. They're difficult. Don't buy them then. <laughs> well, I kind of have to have something on my bottom half of my body. <laughs> Unless you just spend your life on Zoom. There you go. Then I wouldn't have to dress at all. See, in the old days, I would have been able to lift my leg high enough to show you that. Now there's no chance. I think, yeah, all right, okay. <laughs> Huh? My honey oh. Oh. oh, ouch. Oh, that was nice, Val. Make a dress for your dresses for your mom. You're trying to make it so people can't get in here. You're the only one who has trouble, dear. Hello, Glenn. Hello, Glenda. Hi, Glenda. Hi. How are you doing? <laughs> doing good. How about you? Are you in Port Alberni right now? I am. Is it as smoky over there? It is. Uh, it's supposed to start getting better today. Oh, I'll keep my fingers crossed. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> yeah. Aren't you making cards with us, Glenn? No, I'm not. Sorry about that. <laughs> Next time. Yeah. What, you're putting that on? It's 66 degrees in the living room. Oh yeah, I'm furnace. Not putting on heat. Yep. Not here. No. No, I'm not. I'm just changing this to um, off of cool. Otherwise, in, unless you have all, all the units on heat. Are you guys leaving? Yeah, we have to go to school. Oh, life sucks. Eh? It does. Then you an adult, adult. <laughs> and you wish you could be back at school. <laughs> Bye. Bye, guys. See you later. Love you. We might stop over later. Okay, I'll be here.
I will Can accept you? at two o'clock when I'm going to pick my rhubarb up. Okay. Rhubarb, I'm gonna write it in my journal right now. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Point to your head, my journal. Get it in there, get it in there. Yep. I Barbie family. dresses. My mom used to make Barbie dresses too, Val. She was she was a really good sewer. Me, not so much. I was an enthusiastic sewer. Yeah, I would say that was. I had great ideas in my head, and I always thought how an outfit would look on me. I think I had sort of good fashion savvy and everything. Okay. It okay. never, ever, ever turned out. <laughs> That's why I used to do shirts and pants for the boys. Yeah. Not make, so much. I make cute pajamas and, and little just drawstring, well, elasticated waist trousers for them. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh I forgot hey, the inside of my card. Pardon me? I forgot the inside of my card. Oh, well, you better get it done. Yeah, you're not kidding. <laughs> I made um, jeans and i sewed yeah. western shirts for square dancing and i oh, sewed you're good. shirts with collars and i did it all well i was stuck up at the point that i was doing all my sewing i was at mile 63 of the alaska highway then you hang a right and you go in in about 35 miles that's where wow. i was so it was, nothing else was, I didn't do card making at that time. No. So I had to do something. And where did you get your fabric? Because it wasn't online. No, but um, Fort St. John has a huge Hutterite community and they used to have fabric sales all the time. And there was at least two fabric stores in town that I can remember. That's good. Yeah, Chilliwack was like that too. It was Mennonite. But, uh... Oh, well, maybe they were Mennonite, Mennonites. I don't know. They were somebody that did a lot of sewing and they used to bring in huge amounts of fabric and then they'd set up these sales on the weekends. So. I didn't get to go all the time, but, but once or twice a year, I managed it. I even made like night shirts for me and house coats and I did it all. Weird. I was pregnant. I made a lot of stuff. You used uh -huh. to be able Smocks to order from your things. Sears catalog for material too, couldn't you? Yeah. Yeah, Sears, Woodward, oh, maybe the Bay were the, you know, when I came to Canada, I just thought they were the best stores ever. Yep. yep. Oh, and that Christmas wish book. Holy oh, man, yeah. we used to wait all year for that. Yep. Okay, you ready for the great reveal? Yep. Oh, that's Hey. Oh, oh, very pretty. Oh, with the embossing on the back. Oh, yeah. Isn't it amazing how <laughs> nice? Yep. Maybe I should have done happy anniversary. Oh, you know what I forgot to put on there? Okay, this is the original. I forgot to put the bling on. Yeah, that's what I just realized too that I uh... I put oh. some bling on. I have it. I'm just going to do it now. Maybe I should have done happy anniversary and then I wouldn't have had to do tethered. Put it on top. Card. Pop it on top. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I can do that. that. Sounds good. He doesn't need to know. He's not home. He'll never know. I don't know where he is. He went to Sayward yesterday and bought a new out well, new to us outboard motor for our our local boat. Nice. So he's out finding somewhere to store it in case we come to Powell on Sunday because it's in the back of the truck. And he was going to come with me and put our boat to, to bed out there for the winter. Okay, there we are. I put the bling on. I just love that. That's lovely. Isn't that a good layout? And what a great way to use up a whole bunch of strips of designer paper, because you could do it with any designer paper. This is just neat. Look at that. I'm all tied it up already. I love this. <laughs> <laughs> fabric land. Yes, fabric land. 
When I grew up in Vernon, I don't think there was a fabric land there. My mom, my mom did a lot of sewing too. I love oh, Flapper Canada in Richmond. Okay, here's my card. Wait, wait, I gotta, I gotta click on you so we can highlight you. So, okay. Nothing like yours. Yeah. Oh, is that ever cool? <laughs> oh, that's cool, cute. What nothing, a lovely way to use your designer paper strips. Nothing like um, yours. <laughs> mine is more formal. Hang on, Carmen. There's mine. Oh, you ah. got oh, lovely. That's oh, awesome. Nice. I so, ended up because of the way I cut the paper, I went, oh, I got to go the other way. <laughs> and seeing them, I think with the, the, the strips, I would keep the length of the strips, but I would cut them on a diagonal so that they were wide at the top and thin at the bottom or different shapes. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So rather than just parallel sides, I would maybe cut it a little like that. Then yeah. Another one, maybe a cut off the top. A little yeah. ge geometric more, I think. I'm well, gonna... that's because that's the way you roll and my OCD would never let me do that. Do that. And see, when I did it with Glenn, it was like working with Linda again. It was <laughs> precision and neatness. And then he did such a good job, but everything had to, no, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait. I think, oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Put it down there. Just do it. No, 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 no. Oh, oh that's funny. Good. <laughs> Way to go. This is a pretty little girly card I, I can use for a little granddaughter, I think, with the pink. Yeah. Don't forget to send me a picture or post it in the comments. Oh. You too, Carmen. Okay, okay. Because I like I like seeing the different variations of the cards when we're doing this whole mystery thing. My Facebook has frozen again. I hope it's just me that it's freezing for. And not everybody. So Valerie, have you done, finished your card? Louise? Who else was on there making a card? Color. Yeah, I don't know why this Facebook keeps freezing. It's bizarre. All right, I sent it to you in uh, Messenger. Okay. Because it's open on my other little one. It's easy. I can look on my phone. Oh, I'm not using it. Aha. Got it. I will post it. Go. That is cute. It's, it's fresh. Fresh. It is. Simple and fresh. All righty. The day is full of possibilities. Every time I get on Facebook, my nose starts to itch. It's like when I put my mask on and go into a store. Inevitably. Yep. Or I start coughing, which I, I'm not doing, but I put it on and then everyone's looking at me you know, with this mask on. And <laughs> you have the COVID cough. Mm -hmm. Okay, for those of you on Facebook, thanks for joining me. I'm going to end the streaming. And if you made a card, please send it to me so I can push, post it in the comments or post it in the comments yourself. And I'll be back Thursday morning at 10 o'clock with something. And then I'm adding Friday night at eight o'clock for right. some late night stamping. And that's going to be just on Facebook Live. It won't be Zooming. And I'll be creating something. God, oh Friday, God what? Friday at eight. Friday, 8 p.m. Yep. It's in the journal. Okay. Bye, Facebook. See you soon.